Greetings everyone, Ajon here, another couple of years, one replay. So on the south side as the Panzer Elite and Wehrmacht, we have Brutal Hammer and his ally as the, is Floyd the Barber. So on the north side we have Donald Duck and Daisy Duck. Bar counting trashes, probably map. So they're expecting map paths. Not so sure. how accurate it is, but granted seeing how they're both named Donald and Daisy Duck, it's likely that they are in a pre-made team, the way how these guys are communicating, they may be also in a team. Wow, that HQ looks really off-center if you look at this map. It looks like it's out of the sector, but it's clearly barely in the sector. G-43s are on the Panzer Grenadiers. Looks like this one, it will be eyeing the capture this point here. Infantry contact! Kettengrad is rolling on forward, trying to capture this munitions point. We do have a Schimmerwagen here. This is, of course, the uh, Veramok version, so it does have the MG42. We have lost a unit Ooh, to the, the enemy's advances. Ooh, the goes down quite quickly. No repairs on the Schimmerwagen. And you got the Universal Carrier now pushing forward. It is loaded with some infantry as well. Sherman is eyeing to engage as well. Scope rifles are here. And so it's the 243s on the Panzer Grenadiers. Jeep coming to support these Panzer Grenadiers are going near or retreat back sooner rather than later. They're just way outnumbered. Intersection 2, go ahead and garrison inside this building. And we do have the H2 now pushing very far forward. Be able to provide some good pressure. Likely going to see a 25 pounder or two. My prediction. And the bird player could just uh, try to lay down some places down the card, these two points. Achtung! Enemy forces are attacking our petrol depot. Jeep Base here, hitting the Let's Panzer Grenadier squad, but rolling some big misses. You have, what's that, Light AT? Was that the, that looks like actually the carrier half track, not the Light AT. So it looks like we're going to have transport versus transport. While Shiverbogen versus Jeep. MG. Is he calling out an MG or is he requesting an MG? Uh, the US player didn't deploy out any MG yet. And the only way can, the Brit player can bring up build an MG can build an MG in place, or you can go ahead uh go for commandos and bring out the HQ, but he's pretty far away from that HQ. Rifleman will fall back, and we do have the MG42 now coming in to support and getting inside this building. This is a great building for the MG42. Folks around here are in the air, ready to support. Brens are now upgraded on one of these squads. MG42 and Folks around here are engaging this rifleman squad, Jeep, and the Bren squad is here to support, but loosely. He's trying to go for a flank here, but we do got the transport half track, which also can provide forward reinforcements, engaging the scope squad, getting some good damage down. Ooh, some nasty hits there. What on earth got it? We do have a basic three inch mortar emplacement. Does do a nice body block there. Available to take the field. And Patrick's are now available. Do you see any Patrick's of upgrading these squads? No, we do not. He's reinforcing the G43 squad. 
G4-3 squad is as wounded as it can be. What you could do is also, somebody just, you can you can heal from your t allies to HQs. You can actually potentially send out Pentagrindir over here, build a building to give his teammate healing, and not rely on medical crates or anything like that, or med packs. Pentatrex are now available, does load them up immediately in the half track, as was the G43 squad. Shemavagan severely wounded. Pandashrek fires an out of control universe carrier, but he does lose Shemavagan. Destroyed but another enemy vehicle. Minor loss. Shemavagan and like he don't last very long. And the universe carrier was a bit more problematic, to say the least. Looks like some sandbags are coming on out. The jeep is rotated around. You will get one increment of sandbags up. And here comes the uh, half track. Does the get a brick hit on the jeep, destroying it. Does go for a damage resistance upgrade because it's primarily there to carry troops, not to attack. And we do got a Vermox sniper now out on the field. Mortar team engaging. Ooh, that house that needs to get out of there. But he, he does get out of there. And Our brothers they, have fallen. But goes down to the rifleman squad. Very nice. Ooh, and that rifle, this uh, Panzer Deer squad with the G43s needs to fall. Get out of there. Does that have a medical crate there because he's quite low in health? We do have a Kriegsberg coming on out. And still on the. Oh, mortar half track. Very nice. The mortar half track is probably going like to garage this mortar emplacement. Book of Doctrines. The Pantsley player has nothing so far. His teammate has gotten for the Fatherland, which I believe that's for defensive. I always get defensive and and uh, Blitzkrieg mixed up. I think that is defensive. Nothing here. Calling from the map pack. There was that mortar team, the machine gun in place. Uh, Getting hit by the mortar, so they may be right about that. I'm not exactly sure yet. Sometimes it's hard to tell if your opponent had brief vision and saw it deploy up or not. Defensive operations have been upgraded. Kampfgruppe can now use the feared Luftwaffe ground forces. We do have Dr. Lockin of Luftwaffe ground forces. We do got the... The engineer squad now coming on out. Kiets are here. Getting one good hit there. Repair something. Oh, we do have a Ford HQ here. Very nice. Oh, repair bunker. That's what he's meant. And there was likely a ping that we don't see. To take the fight to the enemy. Form up, crew. So this repair bunker is out on the field. We've got the recovery station as well. AT soon. He's wanting a pack 38 because Pencil Elite, as with the Brits, can't deploy their own AT guns.
Oh, some incendiary grenade apparently has been fired. Rolled a big miss. Black Irving receiving fire. And it looks like it did. It may have got actually destroyed, not cancelled. Looks like a 25 pounder has been built. Yep, here it is. A lot of burning corpses there. The vehicle's been plugged in by the Bren gun. And he will go ahead and escape on out there. We got uh, Helium coming on out for healing. We have lost a vehicle. Pantrix and moving on forward does destroy that mortar placement. That mortar placement was being quite effective. It's a pretty cheap mortar placement as well. Another structure being built. It is the Campcraft Center. We need already Nebel Warfers and S uh, 5251 Half Tracks. We don't know if there's a availability of Half Tracks. We saw a defensive doctrine, but that doesn't give them any artillery to use. I know in the campaign there's like artillery available, but not in multiplayer. And when I say campaign, I mean the, uh, like in the, uh, Tales of Validosum, uh, artillery places in that, along as well as, like, the Nash Horns. The squad does get pinned down. Sniper's still around. Pantastrex is being very effective. There is an AT gun here. If he doesn't have Hotch Kisses, then it's... He, then the Hanson player will not be able to deploy out any sort of artillery. So he's going to have to, uh, Vermont players going to have to rely on providing the artillery. is losing ammunition depot to the enemy. Medical center does in fact go down, so no more forward healing or forward casualty recovery. Ooh, some great hits there by the mortars. This is one mortar half track. That is the infantry half track. There's two mortar half tracks. I'm curious, why do people get the defensive upgrades? Why not the attack upgrades? So doesn't the attack upgrades help with the mortar half tracks, or does it not? We need to move, or the unit will be lost. U.S. sniper is out on the field. There is no longer one man squad. There was one. Forward healing thanks to this HQ. Do you feel that, boys? The enemy is seizing our territory. Quite quiet. Gun here. Another 25 pounder is being has been built. One of our sectors has been cut off. Let's take a quick look at the uh, doctrines. Virtual artillery has been selected. Here's been no doctor selected for the Brit. The HQ has received quite a bit of fire now. And we do have off map howls shoot, so infantry doctrine uh, has been selected for the US player. Ooh, that's a massive uh, heroic charge there. But we have Blitzkrieg being activated as well. Stu. It would probably would be pretty good for the anti infantry. Except you already select the doctrine. Panzer Four C's will even be good if they don't have access to Hotchkiss. He's trying to hit the Pantrex against that AT gun. If they can take out the AT gun, then they can bring in some armor. Ooh, that squad is almost down. Ooh, but there goes the MG team. That squad goes down as well. Casualty recovery for the... Is that the US player? No, that's for the Brit. Oh, more artillery raining on in. Did a squad just get wiped out right there? MG42 has been playing, but it's severely uh, damaged, so Piets could potentially take it out. 
Bars have been upgraded over here. We do have the mortar half tracks. We've got a machine gun bunker here. And these mortar and uh, half tracks are doing quite good work. We have regained the momentum on the field. Floyd the Barber is the Panzer Elite player, so he's calling out to build Panthers, which is pretty standard in 2v2s and 1v1s. What are your orders? The 4H group's like to go down soon. Unit down! And the Minesweeper squad does go down. That's a lot, a lot of defenses there. Also, the amount of infantry they're seeing, Panzer Fours may be a bit better than Panthers. And I still believe the uh, short barrel Panzer IV would be great right now. The enemy advances. Let's see. Only the Brit has selected a doctrine. Uh, a doctrine has been selected. Command points are down, but we don't see what it is. So that means... If he goes on the right path, he could perhaps be going for commandos. Royal armor... Possibility... We got these SMGs here, which are going to be very effective against these uh, intersection at close range. We've got a massive heroic charge here. This building is garrisoned. Looks like Vet 2 tree has been researched. Hendrix from the does take out the AT gun entirely. And I think it's no butterfly bombs coming down by the Luftwaffe player. And that is right into a retreat path, so that could be out. very, very deadly. No mines in the area, so I'm so surprised these guys are... Yep, they just got camouflaged. Machine gun bunk here receiving fire from an anti tank gun from somewhere. Or it was the howitzer, and the howitzer and does take it out. And there goes that half track. That was the reinforcement half track. More, nope, that was a mortar half track. Here's the reinforcement half track. I'm trying to think what deduction this person's gone for. What do you want me to do with it? Uh, 25 pounder, take post. Doesn't appear to be defensive because it looks like there's not the additional stuff there take post. to indicate like defensive. So I don't think clear. it's. So it's likely not raw artillery, I believe. It's one of the defensive ability. A victory location is under attack. Something being called on down. I think it's more butterfly mines. Panthers are out on the field. Hitting the HQ would be very advantageous. And the unit 300 points. He is bucking in the vehicle, trying to hit up the howitzers, but the howitzers are nowhere near. Super Sapoos, that would be very, very important. Or wait, that's the uh, Panzer League player, so that, nope, that's the Baramont player. No sig grenades, apparently. MG42 finding a good angle right there. This point is decaptured.
and HB42 has repositioned or books Grandier are in the area as well. You could see a potential snipe shot on the MG42. Contact report. Yep, we saw a snipe shot has been right down. there. He could stick it around because he saw the snipe shot. Repair bunkers has a lot of things to repair. As rep indicator, captain is KIA. Ooh, and the captain apparently has gone down. Pioneers, the Volksgrenadier, and now even some Knights cross holders are out on the field. Sniper does get a good hit there. Volksburg here does get a good hit there. Target. Casualties are being recovered. Knight's Crossfire does push back a lot of infantry. Mortar half track. Reinforcement half track. And both of these Panthers are here. One of them's are wounded. Knight's Crossholder needs a fallback sooner rather than later. Some big hit there, probably from the mortar half track. Smithy fucked! Smithy fucked, mate! We need already in infantry, not tanks. Oh, did he say go for Panthers? So he went for Panthers. He could get out some folks from Jaegers eventually. And I assume he doesn't have access to the Hotchkiss, or as we would have seen it sooner. MP4 is now making their advance. Suppression comes uh, comes down from this uh, half track. And we got riflemen laying down some field defense, and we do have the sappers here laying down some mines. Upgrade done. Ready to get into it. Jenny's gonna have one hell of a surprise. What do you want me to do with them? Oh, detonates that mine. And MG42 is in the area, but does do a heroic charge there. But we'll run straight into two Knights cross holders. Live off ground forces are here. Gain some good hits there on the rifleman squad, but those but those nice crotch holders are severely wounded. And here comes the HS129 B3. But these nice cross holders are severely wounded. This nice cross holder needs to fall back, he's gonna go down. Retreats back both of them, that was way overextending. He can still easily go down. Jerry's pushed Guess through not. our lines and is trying to take a victory point. Fulton Yeagers have been built. Live off ground forces down to up to one left star, but you see. A lot of casualty recovery, that's for sure. are after one of our munitions depots. Oh, here we have the HQs reporting they have destroyed a German target. Intersections engaging. Minesweeper will decapture the point, but may need to fall back. Could get sniped. Ready for action. Overall, it looks like the Allies are pretty battered when it comes to losses. The Axis players seem like they are in a stronger position, in my opinion. Looks like a Stukas of Foos does fire and did roll a pretty big miss. 
the war from half track. Unless it's Neville War first. Nope, there's a half track. I didn't hear a Neville Warfer. You don't hear the Neville Warfer sound effect if it's the half track. Nice cross holders are making an advance once again. Still no doctrinal selection. Unknown number of enemy are moving on one of our victory points. And the VP was protected. Sniper here needs to fall back. He can get quickly ripped apart by the next nice cross holder. And Panzerstrikes are going to will decrew the AT gun there. And does get suppressed there by the bars. That looks like a hit, but of course doesn't kill him because Knights nice cross holders are very resilient. Kettengrad moving the center of the map, camouflaged. Gets spotted by a cow to be right there. Strategic location. G43s and Folks and Jaegers are here. Howards are ripped apart that squads. That of course is actually M2. MP40s inside this building. Knights cross holders are making an advance once more. They may they may will have some trouble versus that uh garrison, that's for sure. And the uh, MP4s are falling back. Gave some good hits, and that's a great Warferman hit. Contact reports show the German vehicle was knocked out. And there goes the HQ. So no more forward reinforcements, and not mention the casualty clearing station is also severely wounded. I don't think you reinforce off the casualty recovery station. Maybe you can. He's... No, you cannot. Have the momentum. We're down to 100 points. Set trench complete, Captain. We do have the Panther receiving a PH hit there. Bunker being built, one Pioneer model left. Out of two. Looks like, based on how much health he has left, looks like the other model got sniped. Here comes the Warferman. Ooh, nearly got the sniper. German target has been knocked out. We're done upgrading. Render so replacement. Taking fire. We have our orders, lads. We're setting up mobile HQ on this position. It's actually a lot of Panthers. How many Panthers does he have? He has four Panthers, which are very the silly and have but had no points. counter the entire June time. Have our victory. Looks like the Warpman does roll a big miss there. Pretty tight barrage that time. Knight's Crossholder needs a fall back. That is a severely wounded Knight's Crossholder. Assault grenades coming on forward. The squad needs to fall back. He's about ready to lose it. An enemy unit has fallen He's to our fall back a lot victory. Sooner. The enemy sent them out. That low health we now have incendiary grenades well, at our disposal. If it's when that side low health, you need to fall back. Another warfman. And then the allies are down to the last 20 tickets. Target destroyed. They just lost too much infantry. They were just spamming the entire time, and they just. Focus on the second ball is unsuccessful. Attention! The enemy One advances. person has backed out. I'm just going to go ahead and pass forward. Supply lines are broken. We have territory cut off from supply. And that is the end of the game. This is A. John saying thank you for watching and signing off.